Hello guys, welcome to Collateral Damage. We just finished um, a little. Uh, if you were watching my live stream, you should probably watch that first because that will have interesting Tobo, Robo, and Tomo. Ooh. Um, you should watch my live stream first. That, that has my kind of my last bit in it of whatever we were just doing here. Oh, but uh. Welcome to Elixir 2, um, Elix 2, god I'm so used to saying Elixir, welcome to Elix 2, this is going to be the second episode, we're having fun, um, we just ran around kind of the map and went to this little town, I now have a buddy named Bully, he was actually a pretty, I wouldn't say mean guy, but he was a pretty uh, interesting person in the last, I think, game. <clears throat> I need to hints. All of the hints go away but yeah no welcome this is actually a pretty fun game I think y'all should definitely get into um, definitely watch my stream of this because it will explain a lot more of what kind of went down or I'll show you what I did in the last few minutes because as much as I love you guys I do not want to explain myself with that all over again because it was a lot it was an hour of such of me running around Trying to uh, kind of just see how the world is. I just was talking to some of the higher ups in the game. That's essentially what I'm doing. For the factions, that's what I was doing. Nice looking place here. See man made item over there, which means we can go to it. Did I already? Yeah, I already went up this way. So what we're doing is we're essentially going north now, or yeah, that's what we're healing herb. We need those. We need those for crafting and stuff like that. Promise you, promise you, we do. Ah, uh, let's see. Oh, let me move my chair this way. Meadow herb. Ah, <gasps> a bird. No, mind, it's not a bird. <clears throat> I love it because the um, because helpers like that or companions just make things a lot easier. Oh wow, he just nice, nice, nice. Please tell me there's a teleporter around here, please, because those definitely help with the traveling aspect. It's gotta be over here, so. But no, Bully is a really interesting character. Is he a good one? Eh, I don't know. Don't know if he's a good one. I know he's a fun character. Why is there a broom? Watch out! Ooh, a gun. See, sometimes I don't know if I'm supposed to be in these areas because they look so big or if they're just kind of like yeah just go here take out it take everything it doesn't matter oh can i not take the can 
energy drink. Okay. Because this shows me all the items now, because I have that beautiful uh, glasses now, which help me for some reason. Don't make sense, but damage blaster, raw poultry. And you need all this so you can collect everything. Dark Helix. And yes, this game is very much a lot of collecting. So if you don't like that, then it's not, I'm not saying it's bad, but like you're gonna have to get used to it because that's kind of how the game works and how I work in these games. Crap. Because it's just easier. It's just easier to do. It's also good for you later on. <clears throat> Seriously, where's another teleporter? I need it. This is also, I think, where you get some of your um, money. Yeah, because Elixir received 100. Go this way. Man, I got a lot of weapons that are kind of. Oh, yeah, resistance to radiation. Don't need that. Oh. Oh, fully mighty. So now we need to go up here. Dang, that's gonna suck, because that means I have to remember where to go to find all the old chests that have all the locks and stuff. Again, I have not found that many human adversaries, which is kind of sad, because I would like to fight them. But at the same time, I get it. I'm kind of glad I don't. Because they are not easy. They usually have a lot better armor than you. Usually. Hope saving. I, I hate that because it lags every now and then, but that's all it's doing is just... Um, that's all it's doing is saving, which is still... It's good, but let's see. Toy train... And yes, I collect everything because you can sell all the little things, which may not be important to you, but it's important to me because money. Money is a thing in this game that's kind of important. Also didn't realize there was... <gasps> Did it not activate? Once you live here a long day. <clears throat> Crater Cliff. <coughs> <coughs> doing all this first because it definitely is going to help me in the long runs like in other areas so if you don't want me to ah, hmm. so if you don't want to watch me well snow claw <laughs> God, that is stupid. But that was a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. A broom. I like brooms. And that's why I collect everything, just so I can have everything I need right where I need it. Scrap, scrap, scrap. Okay. Let's see what's in the destroyed building. Really? 
nothing's in the building? You're telling me nothing's in the building. Okay. I don't believe it, but... I like these areas, but... I already went... Oh. Strong armor is all well and good. But to turn turn off. off. I'm sorry. I just don't care. Uh oh. I'm coming for you. I'll get you. Ooh. Oh, humans, they're not stupid. <clears throat> Fuck. That's why I do not fight people. I do not have the armor and health and anything to do it, and I don't have the weapons strong enough to kill them. I should just fire them with my arrows. My bow and arrows are stronger. Please tell me the self pause in there still. It's better to stick to the reliable advantage of technology. Whether it's a shotgun or a laser weapon, anything better than the risk of disease. Turban speaking. Yeah, I'm not doing all that again. You won't get away from me. Get ready. I guess I'm not fine. Those guys, god damn it. It's always annoying because the game is fun, but you can't do anything until you get armor. Until you, I think until you really join a faction. That's the only time you really get... that I need. <clears throat> I can just walk away. What's that thing <clears throat> doing? God. I just I got a lot of stuff but nothing I'm
That's good. That means we can just bug off. Oh, it's raining. That's horrible. Let's go this way like we we're supposed to. Oh, let's see. Let's see. Fun game. Kind of difficult, though. If you're not careful. Because obviously, if you haven't realized, you can die kind of quickly. Oh, it's snowing. God, so that must be cold as hell. So let's just go in here. See if we can collect. You should try climbing up there. Maybe you'll find something. And if not, maybe I'll get lucky and you'll fall off. Oh, these glasses are freaking life sin, man. Because they help so much with just finding all the little things. Mooshan! Old flyer. Man. Mana. Cash box. Crap. Everything. Uh, that is one problem I've seen is that in this game your person will kind of just turn around without you without you supposed to be doing that. Oh god, oh god. Elix potion, which means one skill point. <clears throat> Ooh, specializations. Ooh, <clears throat> easy to open now. Good. So, I feel sort of bad, but not really. Okay, so this is where things really gonna get interesting. Because we're starting to get to the Albs, I think, are the Albs. Also, you need experience. You need, you need to kill everything. Except for people. That will not go well. Because... Because with this game, clearly, as you've possibly seen, things can kill you kinda quickly. First things first, teleporter, where are you? There's gotta be one around here. Gold ore. Carton of cigarettes, cheese. That was a big carton. <laughs> Yay, I need 
priority. Okay, so another place to have a bunch of stuff. That's one of those things though, a lot of stuff. Ooh, old med kit, scrap. Uh, scrap is useful for other stuff. I think for making things or improving things, which you kind of need to do later. good oh yeah wines from making certain potions god i feel bad because the game really is like heavy amounts of just running around collecting stuff and you have infinite weight so you don't have a weight system so it's like oh i need that oh god that's gonna look weird Bingo. Terror bird dead. Nice. We like it. <gasps> Experience. Oh, I, I haven't leveled it up again. Wah. Big sad. <clears throat> you can't sleep while you're being attacked. Shame. <clears throat> A map piece. Those seem to be kind of important, which I still don't. So we're just getting we are here solely on the basis that he hasn't that he helps kill everything for me. That's the only reason why I'm still alive. Symbol of Kalan. So 
Oh, we're almost there. We're going through the city. Also, they don't, don't exactly tell you, like, oh, there's a bunch of enemies here. I need whatever's in there. Ah, oh, this kind of helps me figure out what I need, because money, or flyer. Oh, experience for some reason. Ooh. Wine. Oh, it's kind of serious. Ooh. <sighs> Let's do this. So something five is less than six is less than seven is greater than four. So two, three, so two, three, six. Let's see, give me a second. Oh, two, three, eight. Bingo. Close enough. Who on earth are you? Twenty-five? No, twenty-four. Then subtract the root of. What is it? Can't you? See? I... Yes, yes. I'm sure that's very important too. But I. Re I'm trying to solve. You wouldn't. Oh, now that I think about it. So I'm sure you've traveled all over. I'm just not here. I'm lacking in her. No, I didn't mean it like that. There's a formulary in a factory not too far from here. We went there recently. But my partner Carl had to flee. But maybe. Cute. Here. So that person exists, that's good to know. Kind of random, I will say, because I didn't expect. Directly behind us. Oh, yeah. I wonder why she's behind us. Maybe she's in the fucking city. I need to go through. Go. Bingo. Um, can I use the? Is 
sock will want to know your name. Sure. A lot has changed. Come on, I'll show you. Okay, so. I'm no idiot. The guy's leading us straight into one of their damn machines. If I wanted to do that, I would have done it by now. But it's your decision. That's nice. Planning on staying? Let me see. You see, the thing is, you're not exactly popular. Many among us want you dead for what you did to the hybrids. Speaking of dead, good luck. There's an execution. We've really. Verdict has been passed. Unlawful efficiency has been proven beyond reasonable doubt. Accepted the judgment. Execute the convicted party. Good work. Know the drill. Pick up your posts as soon as you're done. I was wondering how long they were going to let him get away with this behavior. Next, we'll head on over. Oh, I remember these. Right now, we're standing in front of the Holding of Rhesus. This is where the optimal level of e-waste consumption is calculated. A month. That depends. A tactician who doesn't fear for his troops won't be an effective tactician. On the other hand, a guard who's afraid of killing is not an efficient guard. The middle way seems to be the best choice. Completely emotionless, didn't it? But too many among them. And when it comes to making these calculations, now if you have no more questions, follow me. Uh, I guess I'm following you, Reddick. We're talking about an experiment. What should I expect? We're trying to breed children who. Hang on. You're doing what? We're creating a new generation of rationally thinking tactics. I don't ever want to fight that thing. That thing will kill me. The lesson from last time should still be within easy recall. We'll practice it again today. Yeah. Good. Now, remember yesterday's practice. Concentrate. Do not make me repeat myself. Feel the emotion welling up inside you. Remember last week's punishment. Feel the fury it caused rise inside you. If it threatens to overwhelm you, try focusing on the equations we learned yesterday. Were you able to call up the anger? So, I want you to give me the solution to the problem. If not, we'll repeat last week's punishment. Inefficiency will not be tolerated. Practice at home, then complete a three-page report on your emotional stability and disease. Makar, I especially want to see yours. I'm concerned about your progress. Improve. Yes, ma'am. Session complete. You can go.
giving kids Elix? No. We're experimenting with not giving the kids Elix. Teaching them to think logically and precisely without it. Most Albs never learned to handle emotion. Without Elix, many of us are completely at the mercy of our feelings. Mm. That's what we're trying to prevent from happening with these children. They're taught how to deal with emotions without neglecting their official things. Without it, they're nothing more than normal people, aren't they? No. As soon as they're of age, they'll be given their daily helix rations like everyone else. According to our calculations, with access to helix, emotionally strengthened albs should be able to reach the next stage of evolution. What makes you think this could work? Because it worked in the past. We suspect that's the only reason we were able to stand up to the high point. We're studying this phenomenon and trying to recreate it. But if you want to know more, we are about to enter the collector's set. They're responsible for finding Elix and bringing it to the scientist. It's not particularly bad. So they only get low doses of Elix, which makes them prone to uncontrolled emotional outbursts. If it were up to me, we would let them stay in the deep end. Ship them out somewhere. Let's keep going. I don't like getting around these people. Follow me. You might have noticed that back here it's much more, more disordered. Careful, you might even end up getting robbed. Wouldn't have happened in the hybrid today. A mistake is unforgivable. Ah, so they are the cold hard robots. Luckily, we're now out of the collector's sector. Right here, we're entering the soldiers area. Things are a lot more orderly. These guys make difficult decisions, but they get correspondingly larger rations. On decent weapons. About trading in the depot? We do now. Trade has helped us to create. Let's see. But you can take a look at all that later. I the want to trade. Up there. Their job is to keep an eye on the collectors and everyone else. Make sure everyone takes their Elix ration and that nobody takes more or less. Keep an eye on things. Keep everybody in. This place looks nice, but I know it's like a horrible place to live. God, that thing is fucking huge. And I know that thing will kill you real quick. <clears throat> did not anticipate your return. State your business immediately. Am I supposed to know who you are? I am Alexiter Azok, guardian of the new directive, responsible for the depot. Now answer my question. Circumstances. 
senses force my hand. Circumstances? The description seems inadequate. But if you're willing to assist us, I will tolerate it. You have amends to make. Wait, you're not kicking me out? What my people think of you is a matter for them. But it's because of you that we recognize the value. So I am neutral towards you personally. But I will have if you break up. These new enemies, keeping them in check, ties up resources. Bridging those gaps. Seek out Commander Arissa. She is at a breaking point. But expect no welcome from her. If your work for her is satisfactory, I will. You are getting a second chance. Let me speak to Arissa, God, and then combat robot. Ooh. All right, guys. I'm sorry. I gotta stop it right there. I hope you enjoyed the um, video. Please like, share, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. All right. Peace out.